right, so this is gonna be just a quick check-in. Um, I know I made my post on the community tab about why, you know, things are kind of hectic around here at the moment. Um, but yeah, as of, what day is it today? Tuesday? Uh, two days ago, two nights ago, uh, I just got back into the state of Florida from my home state of Massachusetts after having to uh, leave for a bit. Uh, I was attending a funeral in Massachusetts and I am now back, but unfortunately we now have lovely Idalia approaching the state now, our fantastic hurricane. Um, so yeah, pretty much today is me just sorting things out, moving things in. Obviously, um, I have a lot of plants outside and I don't want things blowing around and that wouldn't be great. So I've got to move all my plants in. Um, and just preparing everything in case of power outages because according to the outage map, we are very likely to lose power during this storm, which, you know, it's already getting dark out there and the effects are supposed to start anytime now and it makes landfall um, around 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, I think they said, uh, as a category three storm. Uh, some stations are seeing potentially worse but we're gonna hope that it's not uh anyways so yeah just preparing everything in advance boiling water to have uh, i have a lot of reptiles and such that need that water so i keep it in jugs and uh, we had already bought bottled water and everything like ages ago months ago uh, we don't wait for hurricane season. We like to just keep bottled water on hand and then we just save it in case we need it for an outage or anything. Um, I don't like panic buying things at the last minute. And yeah, I mean, I went out for a few like small necessities and like snacks. We keep like chips and bread and whatever. We bake cookies and stuff before storms just in case. But that's it. And uh, I don't know, we saw, I literally saw people at Aldi yesterday buying entire cases of the half gallon whole milks. I don't know why you'd need several cases. I don't know if this is a re like a reselling situation or what's going on, but I, I have my single gallon of milk, which I mean, I need it for cereal, but I mean, if power goes out, it goes bad anyways, because it's refrigerated, right? So I never quite understood why everybody hoards milk in things that go bad when there's going to be a storm that could take the power out um, but yeah we get chips cookies stuff like that that's can be eaten when the power goes out and that's basically it we're just going to be chilling out here um i haven't heard anything from work as far as tomorrow goes for anyone who does not know i work out in disney i do work in an outdoor area um so I'm not quite sure what they're doing. I know they're monitoring the situation. Uh, so just to keep an eye online, to see if uh, they make any, any uh, decisions regarding tomorrow, Wednesday, excuse me. And all the local schools and everything are gonna be closed. Um, Orlando airport's operating per usual, but monitoring um, Tampa area, like their airports announced that they'd be closed starting at midnight last night or today technically i don't know um so they've already been closed and will reopen when it's safe to do so and yeah so i know the biggest impacts we're gonna have here uh, we are a little more inland which is great um, but we do get localized flooding especially where we are um and there is a risk we are on the eastern side of the storm. And for anyone who doesn't know, they call that the dirty side of the storm, which is where you get like the spin-off uh, bad weather. Uh, there's like a higher tornado risk, things like that, that we have to personally watch for. So, you know, while things like surge aren't really an issue here, which is fantastic because surge is really scary. Um, you know, we don't have to worry about that. We just have to worry about wind, um, tornado threat, and, Yes, basically it. Typically I like to get sandbags because we flood very easily. It literally during regular heavy storms, we do get water up over the lanai and you know, the door's right there and water can seep under the door into our living room. 
and so I normally like to have sandbags on hand but unfortunately this time around I do not <laughs> so it doesn't look like anybody here does this time and usually I see at least a couple other um, like apartments have some sandbags out front but I don't see any so that's fine I'm just gonna take in my plants that I can take in and move everything so that we don't lose anybody along the way uh, and yeah, we're just gonna hang out, chill out, and I have some good books to read and things in case we lose power, and it's gonna be fine and dandy. Uh, but yeah, I hope everyone else is staying safe, though. It's it's pretty uh, nasty-looking storm, and I feel bad for anyone affected by the surge or, you know, where this is, like, directly where this is making landfall, and so I hope everyone's staying safe, and, you know, yeah. We're gonna ride this out together, I guess, right? <sighs> but that's it. Um, what day is it? I'm gonna make a Wagovi update later this week, which will be nice. And I'm trying to think if there's anything else to report on, but really, there isn't. <laughs> like I said, oh, I, this is a bad example because my hair's just like tied back and all a mess right now because I've just been fumbling around trying to get things prepared, but I got my hair did up. Um, this light is horrible because it's dark outside and I don't have a light on right now. It's a mess, but I do have some like copper low lights in my hair now and some nice blonde highlights in here. I mean, what you've seen before now has been my natural hair color. It's like a dark kind of dirty blonde color naturally and that color is still in here. I also do have like a little side shave in here. Whoop. There we go. It's not a huge one, but I think it's cute. It's just a little something something. And it looks cute when I have my hair like actually down and I pin it back a little bit. I don't know, it's been a while since I've really updated you all. Uh, but anyways, that's that. I'm gonna go ahead and take care of the last few things that I need to get done before this weather really starts hitting. It just started raining outside here. I should have figured it's dark, so I gotta go close the window real quick. But anyways, I hope everyone's staying healthy and happy, and especially during this storm, please stay safe, okay? If they ask you to evacuate, please evacuate. Otherwise, you know, do, do all the stuff, prepare all the things, have emergency kits just in case, because this is Florida. It's probably not the last storm we're gonna get ever, right? Always good to have that stuff on hand. Anyways, I will see you all again very, very soon, hopefully.